What's up guys, my name's Lane and I'm with my cousin Shane today. We will be doing a review on Lego Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Turtle Lair Attack. Age recommendations is age 6 to 12, set 79103. Okay, I really love this set. The best thing about it is the minifigures. Lots and lots of minifigures. I'll show them up close now. Now this is Sensei, little Spinter, and nice printed torso, and little skirt thing. He's got two katanas, and nice back print. And his face, as you can see, is pretty awesome. And um, this is the Dark Ninja, or forward slash Chris Bradford. Nice printed torso, two black katanas. And he does have a back print, not sure if you can see it. And he does carry the Ninja Star. So there you go, there's your black ninja. I like this minifigure. It is a training dummy, but they could have done more on the torso, like little tears and rips, like the turtles have been training on it. So I'm going to give this minifigure maybe a 5 out of 10. And here's the foot ninja, which I really, really love these minifigs. You get one in every single set, which is really cool. A nice printed torso, nice back print. It comes with the blade thing and a ninja star. His head is really awesome, the Foot Clan sign. I'm gonna give that figure a nine out of 10. Awesome. And here is Wrath, my favorite turtle. He comes with his two sides, and you get, do get one spare, as you can see here, and you get a spare Leo's katana. And there is his lovely printed torso shell. Nice leg prints. And there's his heart shell. So I'm going to give that minifigure a 10 out of 10. Sorry guys. And Splinter, I'm going to give that minifigure a 9 out of 10. And Dark Ninja, maybe a 7 out of 10. They could have done a lot, lot better with that ninja. Last but not least is Leonardo. A really awesome minifig. A nice printed torso. Um, um, like a shell. If you take the shell off and all the turtles, there is a back print shell. And it comes with his two katanas, and that's Leo. There's your figure. I'm gonna give the figure a 10 out of 10. I give all the turtles a 10 out of 10. They're really awesome. Okay, so there it is. There's your minifigs. And it comes with rafts and Leo's skateboard. And that's the TV they all sit in. Doesn't really fit well. Um, here is a nice feature, which I like to do. So you can flip that open. Is really cool, and then you can put Wrath here. And then this is Wrath swinging on this little thing, which can defeat the Foot Clan shoulders. Booyakasha! Even though that's my control, but I like the same. Okay, you got this? Yep. And here is the pizza oven. You can fire out the pizzas. It's like you. Talk to my assistants, my cousin Shane. There's the pizza oven. You can fire that pizza out, but it's a little complicated, so I won't do it. Here is Donnie's lab, which you can take these drawers out. Really awesome feature. These steps, I'm going to give that scene of the steps maybe a 3 out of 10. These steps are terrible. Could do a lot better. Here's the training dojo. Did you put this little training dummy on? Put this little training dummy on. Maybe Leo facing guy and then. There you go. Um, the set overall, I'm going to give it a maybe a 9 out of 10. It's really awesome, but it could have been a little bigger. Uh, it would have been even better. There is the letters that take them up to the surface. Little escape, little hang, hanger thing, and then little tools. Um, I'll show you something. Okay, I'll 
I'll just put Graph on a skateboard. And then we got like you. Then you can put Leo, no Raph, on this. Really awesome play feature there. I'm gonna show you one more thing before we go. Oopsie days. Darn it. Thanks. And then you can put like he's doing some sort of skill. I'll give you a close up up on the skateboards. You do include, it does include um, refs and Leos. There's refs, really awesome, and Leos with an apple. So, there we go. Goodbye.